How's it going everybody? So in this video, I am going to talk about how to get a girlfriend. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do appreciate the support. It helps my channel grow. Um, please follow me on Instagram, DylanBerg999. So the key for getting a girlfriend, and this is something that a lot of people don't really understand, is that the key doesn't really matter about how you look. This is what a lot of people think. Um, they always think that you need to be physically attractive. And a lot of people think, oh, I'm ugly. There's no way to switch that. I'm never gonna get a girlfriend or anything like that. And they get super mad and depressed and they just, they kind of lose hope. The number one thing that you need is actually confidence and you need to understand that you can actually improve your appearance. Um, it, it's not really being shallow, but if you're someone that's like 500 pounds, and again, I'm not trying to be rude, but if you're 500 pounds and you can't get out of bed, you're like bed sick because you weigh so much, it's gonna be very hard to find a girlfriend. I mean, you still may, and that's awesome, but it's gonna be extremely hard. So the number one thing that people can do that can instantly make them get a girlfriend faster is to start exercising. Girls look at exercises and they say, hey, this guy's in good shape, he takes care of themselves. And they like that. They like having a good physique for a guy because it shows protection and it shows masculinity. So that's something that's super important. Now I've been doing this, I've been bodybuilding, powerlifting for 11 years. So I've developed an extremely good body. You don't have to do it for 11 years. You could literally just lose 10 to 20 pounds and this might drastically change your pickup game or how you get girls. Literally 10 to 20 pounds, that's all you have to do. And you will notice your body, your face completely switch. So it's not trying to be like rude or shallow, but by increasing your exercise, losing a little bit of weight, that can instantly make you look 10 times better. On top of that, a lot of people might be like, well, even if I do that, I'm still scared to talk to girls. And this is very, very common because our body, what it does is our body doesn't like to be in bad or nervous situations. So what'll happen is your body will prevent you from doing certain types of things. Your body senses that talking to a girl can be scary. It might affect your life, even though it won't, but that's how our body interprets it. And it does things, it puts, um, um, puts words in your mind to prevent you from doing these things. That's why you get scared and nervous and you don't wanna to talk to girls. It's your body doing this to you and your mind to try to protect yourself. So what you can do, and this is super easy to do, is go on dating websites. Super, super simple to do. And I'm not talking about hookup sites. There's lots of dating apps that are actually legit, like Christian Mingle, eHarmony. Um, there's lots and lots of good uh, websites out there or apps that will help you to actually find actual real girls, not just hookup sites. So that's what I recommend doing. The reason why I like doing this is because you email them or text them before you actually talk to them. And this gives you confidence because you're actually connecting with that person and it gives you time to respond. If you're in a face-to-face -face conversation with someone, you need to keep the conversation going. The baddest thing or the worst thing is when people have that awkward silence for like five minutes. With text, that's very hard to do because you can reply, you can wait a minute or two minutes or five minutes or even 10 minutes to respond to a text message. This gives you time to think about what you're going to say. You don't have to do it right away. So it actually calms you down. That's what I recommend doing for people, going on websites, not just any websites, actual websites. And keep in mind the good websites, you generally might have to pay something, which is completely fine. Pay 20 bucks a month to possibly find your soulmate is nothing. So that's what I recommend doing. It can help you out, give it a try. End of video. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. If you haven't already, please follow me on Instagram, DylanBerg999. Thank you.